Inves 91L has pretty much completely fizzled out out here in the Atlantic. The NHC went from a 90% chance to trample development down to a 20%. It just goes to show that it's not until a storm initializes and kind of gets act together that you can really trust some of those long-range models. Now, I get it. Some of the long-range guidance was continuing to show something out there, but it really just had to get through that initialization phase. And you can see right here on our satellite imagery, we got a lot of just those dry weather clouds just off towards its north. Um, that really has just been seeping into it. There's moisture down towards the south, but just not enough to overcome that dry air. So if we take a look, well, first on the top line here, that is Aaron's track. And that really was well developed and defined in the past just north of Hispaniola. And look at the spaghetti plots here on, well, today is Saturday afternoon, right around 2 p.m. And you see how this is just the GFS. The Euro's not even trying to put something out on it. It just fizzles it out here and kind of stalls it out east of the windward islands so and also you can combine that with the dry air which saharan dust has been coming off the west coast of africa along with this wave and it's just been putting a chokehold on it think of if you have a fire and you're trying to burn it you're throwing gasoline on the fire that would be the warm sea surface temperatures but at the same time somebody's just dousing water on it uh, which is what's kind of happened here in a metaphorical meteorological sense uh, just keeping it much weaker and just stifling any development coming out of this area here as it tries to push off towards the west. Now, with that said, um, right here, you can kind of still see maybe another low might try to develop in the Caribbean uh, and push out there south of Jamaica. That is definitely a possibility. Um, still near peak season, so I mean, those sea surface temperatures out there are warm. It definitely needs, still to be, needs to be watched, but at least for this time, 91L has fizzled out. If it did redevelop, it would probably be called 92L. Remember, the L means Atlantic, and then it goes was 90 to 99 it's just those invest numbers i mean once it gets into the caribbean if this thing does somehow manage to keep a defined area of low pressure or at least reorganize this with an area of low pressure definitely would be plenty of energy out there and that's what's being indicated there in the red but don't forget about a week from now is the peak of hurricane season that would be on september 10th also i do want to remind you we have a major cat four heading towards the united states Yes, that is the case here. That is Kiko. Kiko is out there east of Hawaii. It is anticipated to pass north of the Hawaiian Islands. Some outer rain bands could be impacting, but more than likely, this is going to be impacted by dry air. Some passing showers for places like the Big Island, but I wouldn't be worried about it. a cat for coming on shore there. But I should label this video, Major Hurricane Headed Towards the United States. <laughs> talk about a misleading post there but technically uh correct anyways hey the point of these updates here uh, and try to do my best to inform educate so you can make proper decisions uh yourself on these tropical systems and you know what you're looking at when you do see some of these long-range guidances and one thing i do also want to stress this is the spaghettios i like the this is the ensemble men but members within the gfs gfs puts out 30 runs they average it together and this just shows you you know looking out to the the 16th look how we have a circle there circle there circle there it's all over the place right in here that does show vast uncertainty in that long range outlook but it also does show the model still wants to kind of pick something up as we approach the peak of hurricane season and thus something could be out there so i want to make sure you guys always stay posted stay informed and stay educated if you have any questions or anything like that let me know and make sure you check out firstcoastnews.com slash hurricane central for more information